In this video, I'll teach you how to work in offline mode in either Project Online or Microsoft Project Server. There are two situations that would force you to work in offline mode with an enterprise project. One of them is when you're going to be away from your corporate network, such as when you're flying on an airplane on a business trip. The other situation is when you lose network connectivity. In this video, I'll teach you how to work in offline mode in both of those situations. So let's get started. In the first situation, I need to leave tomorrow on a business trip to Irvine, California, and I want to take this enterprise project with me so that I can work with it on the airplane. So while I'm still here in our corporate office and connected to our corporate network, I need to open and check out the project for editing. Then, immediately, I need to close this enterprise project. But in the confirmation dialog to check it in, instead of clicking the default Yes button, I need to click the No button to leave the project checked out so that no one can edit it while I'm away working with it in offline mode. Once I've done that, all I need to do is to exit Microsoft Project completely. When I'm on the airplane, I need to launch Microsoft Project, but I need to do something different from normal in the login dialog. I do need to leave the profile set to the Project Online or Project Server system that we use in our organization. But instead of clicking OK to work in online mode, I need to click the Work Offline button to work with Microsoft Project in offline mode. Once I've done that, I can click the Open button, and in the Open dialog, I can open the project that I left in a checked out condition when I was still in our corporate offices yesterday. While I'm working with Microsoft Project in offline mode, I can do almost anything that I can do in online mode. For example, these two tasks need to be marked as completed. So I'll select them. And I'll click the 100% Complete button in the Task Ribbon. I can also save the changes to the project, but in the lower right corner of the screen I see an unusual message, Project Offline cannot synchronize data to server. What that means is that the changes I just saved are saved in the local project cache on my computer hard drive, but they have not been uploaded to the server in Project Online or Microsoft Project Server. When I'm done working with the project in offline mode while I'm on the airplane, I can click the Close button, but in the Close dialog this time, I do need to leave all of the default options in place. Do you want to save your changes? Yes, I want to save. Do you want to check in your project? In this case, no, I want to keep it checked out. After I click the OK button, it's now safe to completely exit Microsoft Project again. After returning to the corporate office from my business trip to Irvine, California, I need to launch Microsoft Project, but in the login dialog this time, I need to click the OK button to work with Microsoft Project in online mode again. Then I can click the Open button to display the open dialog, and in this dialog, I can select the project, 
that I was working with in offline mode on the airplane. Once Microsoft Project opens that project, I do need to click the Save button to save the latest changes to the project. And if necessary, I should also publish the latest changes as well. So that's how to work with Microsoft Project in offline mode in the first scenario when you're traveling away from your corporate network, such as on a business trip, for example. The second situation involves working with offline mode when you've lost network connectivity. For example, I've had this enterprise project open for a while, and I've been making changes to it all along. For example, I just learned that task number 23 needs a duration of 12 days, not 10 days. When I discover that I've just lost network connectivity. I don't want to lose the changes I've been making to this project, so here's how offline mode can save me. In the lower left corner of the status bar, I need to click the button that looks like a globe icon. And on the menu, I need to select the option Work Offline. Now I'm working with Microsoft Project in offline mode again. I can click the Save button, and in the lower right corner, I see the familiar message, Project Offline cannot synchronize data to server. But what that means is that the latest changes have been saved to the project copy that's in the local project cache on my hard drive. When network connectivity returns, again I can click the globe icon and choose connect to server, and then I can go ahead and click the save button again, and Microsoft Project will make sure that the changes are saved to the project online or project server database accordingly. Also, if necessary, remember to publish your enterprise project as well. So that's how to use Microsoft Project in offline mode when you lose network connectivity. Well, now you know the two methods for working with an enterprise project in offline mode. As always, I sure hope this video was helpful to you. If it was, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. If you have a question or comment, please leave it in the comment section below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. And as always, I'll see you in my next video.